Good morning everyone. First of all, let's just start with my frothy coffee. Oh my god, I feel really tired today. So I've decided I need an iced coffee, not a warm one today. So you've just caught me put my flavour drops in. But guys, welcome back to another video. So today I thought I would just jump straight in and take you in with my new routine. So I need to catch you up on my fitness goals, um, what I've been doing to reach them, uh, and just all that exciting stuff. So let's kick this start of the video with an iced coffee. I'm actually going to do some work first of all for my clients. Um, I've just got to get back to a few of them this morning. But first I just want to talk about my goals. So at the moment I'm on a lean diet, so I want to get a bit leaner. Um, I'm adding in two extra days of cardio. Now this is just steady state as well as my steps. So I'm just doing um, 20 minutes on the stair step after two upper body sessions a week. That's it, she yeah. Five days a week in the gym. So I do two lower body, two upper body, and then one glute day. So that's kind of my, my gym routine. Um, my calories are still the same like they always have been, but please don't like look at this video and like judge from my calories because mine will be so different to yours I'm doing 12,000 steps a day uh, minimum or if, like one day i might do 19,000 like the other day if you follow me on instagram and then uh, like yesterday i only did 10 because i made up the amount uh, the following day so that is it so i'm really trying to get my low my body fat lowered now um i just want to go i'm on 54.4 and i just want to be in the 53 section um just for like a like a boost of I can do this. Um, it is getting harder now at the end of my cut. Um, I am really looking forward to eating more and doing the reverse diet. So my ultimate goal is to get stronger, so I need to reverse diet eventually um, to ensure that I'm getting stronger. But right now, I'm 54.4 and I'm cutting so let's just hope I'm gonna do this video again next week so let's just hope or I'll fill you in in my next video um that it goes down because I'm praying but first I'm gonna have some coffee and get on some work I'm just on my way to the gym just walked here so I'll do some filming so you can see what I get up to but yeah let's go leg day gym that was a really good session i filmed some of it I didn't film it all so the thing i didn't film was hip thrust because i hit 50 kilogram and i just got so carried away i just completely forgot if i'm really honest with you that was what happened um so yeah i did that and then i had a glute activator and a glute finisher now i've rushed home to the gym because i had a phone call i need to make and turns out they have not called me they're 10 minutes late so if i quickly end this clip is because I've got to take this phone call but I've just put my toffee drops mm, onto my oats this is my oats today everyone mm, mm, mm. I've gone from the frozen berries today I've gone for the biscoff sauce which is delicious I have put pomegranate in my porridge and pomegranate is so low calorie for so much so I thought I'm gonna give it a go so I'll let you know what that tastes like and then I've also got raisins as well because I mean you've got to get your fibre in girls and of course the porridge um, protein. So yeah, bon appetit. Would you look at that? The pomegranate is so nice. It gives the porridge, like the nice soft porridge, a little crunch. So if you want some pomegranate on your porridge, definitely do it, it's delicious. Hello everybody and welcome to the afternoon. So this morning I literally just got some work done. Um, I've had a shower, put a fresh face on, that looks very fresh now actually. Um, and I've got dressed, ready to start my afternoon. So normally afternoon, I've just had my lunch, I'm gonna have a cup of tea now, just 
you know, time over. And normally afternoon, I go for um, a nice long walk, like half an hour, 45 minutes, just to boost my steps. And I definitely need to do that today. I've literally done 5,000. So the goal is 12, guys. So we need to get outside. Uh, I actually just got a really lovely text from Tom's mum. She's going to come and pop round. And we're just going to go roam around, get coffee out and just roam around the shops. Which would be so nice because she's in the flat but her partner hasn't. So they're going to like have a quick tour of our masks on just because they're coming all the way down here. Um, and then we're going to head out. So that would be really, really nice. Go for a walk with them. Have a chill. And I'm actually really looking forward to it. I've been working all morning. So it would be really lovely to do something different. And it was so unexpected and you know like those unexpected like days and treats just are so much better aren't they but i need to clean the flat because it is it's not dirty it's just like like there's mess everywhere like tom's new golf clubs came yesterday so he literally was in his element but like down there there's loads of cardboard boxes and stuff and also oh my god since my last vlog i'm so angry those tables that I told you about, they still haven't been picked up. Like, next just haven't picked them up and it's really, like, annoying us now. We're like, why haven't they not got it? But basically, what you do is you go on their website, you order, if anyone even cares, but you basically, like, request a refund and then you have to do the return, which I've done. And it says the courier will be here on whatever day I choose. And they just don't turn up, so you wait in all day. Four times it's happened now, so I'm fuming. So I'm hoping that Monday they're gonna come, but those boxes are still there. And you know, like when you have guests and you just want them, like, on first impression, you just want them to, like, like what you're, you've done to your house, and, yeah. And so I need to use jobs like that and just empty dishwasher and all those boring jobs. But, yeah, I'm just gonna chill here for a bit and just sit down and chat to you. The one thing I really wanted to talk to you about was my new routine and how it's benefiting me. So, before I started this new routine, I literally was waking up about 6 o'clock, in the gym for half 6, doing my day, and then by 2 o'clock I was just absolutely dead, I was crashing, and I, was, I literally sat here, and I, like, since I've moved into my flat, and I was like, why am I doing this to myself? So, I've made, I've, like, pushed everything back a bit later, so I don't wake up till half 7 now. Um, it's normally 7, I'm not gonna lie, I'm not very good at sleeping at the moment, but, yeah, half 7 is, like, the goal. Um, and then I start my day and it's just so much better. I feel so much more energised and if you can afford to do that, I'm so lucky I'm self-employed so I can obviously do that. Um, it's just so much better, like, love it. So yeah, that's my new routine and why I did it. it was just, I was just getting exhausted. And I am honestly loving, I'm loving it. It's just so much easier, it's much better. I get so much done I'm not as tired. Um, I'm not as hungry as well because obviously I'm like weight, on a weight loss journey, aren't I? So, yeah, all the sleep. He's got all the sleep. But yeah, I'm feeling quite tired actually. I've um, got a bit of a sore throat, so I'm kind of like taking it slow with my cup of tea, you know. Another little update for you, actually, before I never leave you. Oh, my car, the engine light came on, and it says driver's strain. So if anyone knows what that means, please leave it in the comments below. I honestly have no idea. Took it to the garage. They like plugged it in on whatever they do. And I was literally standing there, pooping my pants. I thought, God, if this car costs me a fortune, I'm going to cry. And they literally were like, oh, there's loads of issues with it, but we're going to clear it off. You know, you're just like, sorry, what? Anyway, I told them about the issue. They didn't even know what the issue is. So it's such a weird thing. But basically, what it means when it, it comes off my dashboard, it just means that I can't drive at a certain speed. So I have to go at like 50, 60 miles per hour, honestly. I spent like another 15 minutes on the journey, it's an absolute nightmare. Um, oh, so annoying. So yeah, I'm trying to get hold of Mini today just to say, what is it? So I can tell the garage and hopefully we can get it fixed. But I went to the garage and then they, they cleared all my documents off, said it'll be fine, got in the car and it came back on again. It's whenever I'm driving for more than half an hour, absolute pain. So hopefully guys, we get on the phone. Um, I mean, it won't happen now because it's now the weekend, but you know, by Monday, I'm going to have it done. You know, like, these little problems, guys. Before giving a bit of reality, it always happens. I just wanted to say, I did a giveaway on my Instagram. And I just want to say thank you so much to everyone that has commented and, like, applied for the giveaway. It is so exciting. I've, like, I'm still getting shares now. And I shared it about two days ago now. And um, people are sharing their story. They're tagging us. So it's just the best thing ever. And I just want to say thank you because like all that sharing is just amazing and the fact that there's so many people on there that actually want to win that gift card it's a women's gift women's best um 100 pound gift card i'll put the 
post here so if you haven't seen it go see it um so yeah i just want to say thank you for all the love on that and then it doesn't stop there the next day I put up my transformation photo of my backside, so my bum is all over social media now, but I don't even care, like, I just feel so proud of what I've done. Um, and since February to now I've been on like quite an intense weight loss journey and I'm nearly there guys, nearly there, I'm literally this close, so I'm really really excited to like get to the end, I just can't wait. Um, so yeah, no, I talked to you about that earlier anyway, but um, yeah, I just want to say thank you for the love because it was everyone's just so kind everyone's like wow you did amazing i do get a few weird messages like you look better before or whatever but you know you just got to block the hates out of you and yeah no i just want to say thank you because it means the absolute world um while i'm here guys if you want to see more of these videos and please don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel because i just realized i hadn't even said it yet and that is what keeps this channel going is your support your love your likes your subscribes your comments it does my uh, account the world of good and also i just can't wait to grow like i really can't i just love it um but yeah i'm gonna enjoy my cup of tea and when tom's mum and their stepdad get here we're gonna go for a wander so i might take you around so plans have changed we're actually heading to sainsbury to get some more um tonic water and some gin glasses because i've just broke a gin glass <laughs> didn't mean to it just it literally i put it in dishwasher closed the dishwasher and it broke so i'm not really happy about that tom is fuming at me <laughs> so we're going to take me to get some more stuff so wish me luck we've got the goods we've got the tonic you happy hello you guys so update went to sainsbury's no gin glasses in sight so i'm gonna do my afternoon walk is gonna be going to get gin glasses and wine glasses because guys you need to get the essentials in life you know which it's in the cupboard you know like when you feel like such a child like, i don't even have wine glasses so when like everything opens on the 17th of may and people can come indoors and stuff i was like i literally won't be able to even serve someone like a glass of wine or something and we've got four bottles of prosecco alcoholics or what but no prosecco glasses so i'm gonna look for those as well but i'll take you around on elm i do actually want to get a blanket basket you know like in living rooms you see those really lovely baskets um that have like the the blankets um wrapped up really nicely i really want to get one we've got two blankets that just live on the sofa at the moment so again another little step to finishing the flat but yeah i'm just walking to sun now um and then i'm gonna go home do some more work um and that is kind of like my routine for the afternoon and then of course like a big dinner about six delish so i will catch you in Dunham. For anyone doing home shopping, these stools are so good. They're like little steps. Get an extra big one or a small one. Definitely recommend those guys for five foot four girls like me. So you guys, I'm on the way back to the flat. We all knew when I went into Sun Elm that that was not going to be the case. I was just going to go get some gin glasses. Absolutely not. I've literally got a dead arm from this. Um, I bought a carafe. Now Tom is going to go nuts because before we moved in, we had this joke, and I said to him, I was like, "So I need to get a carafe so that when people come round when they're loud, like we can put some water on the table." And I just think it looks really smart. Like, guys, I worked in catering for about ten years of my life. Okay, no, about eight years, but still quite a long time. And it was just like the nicest touch putting water on a table with like a little bit of lemon and lime, a bit of ice. And if you can agree with this, then comment below. But Tom was literally like. We are not getting a carafe. Guys, it's three pounds, so hopefully he won't go too mad at me. <laughs> Hope not. But yeah, so I've got my bits and bobs, and I'm walking back to the flat now, so I will show you what it looks like. I hope this, I'm really nervous about this basket. I hope it goes with like my theme. I feel like it'll make it feel a bit warmer if it's a bit colder at the moment. Um, so I'm gonna put my blankets in it and let you know. Sorry if you can hear that really annoying clanking, it's the glasses bought a craft and a wine glass right here's my little basket guys obviously it's not the same color as that but we we all knew that but i do just think that looks quite cute there obviously i need to put the blankets in oh no i do actually quite like that oh guys it does look kind of cute doesn't it 
Oh, I do actually like it. I do think I would, but actually I do. And you know what? Even if I get sick of it, I can always put it like by the saver so you can't really see it. So yeah, I think that's a winner, everybody. Let me know if you like it or not. I actually do care about your guys' opinions. This is what I was banging on about earlier. For God's sake, I'll just show you the colour of it and how dark it actually is. Because it's such a nice, like such nice tables, but it's just so dark. Like look at that. Let me get a better lighting for you, hold on. Like, look at that colour that over there and guys it's really not the most exciting Dunelm trip ever but I got a red wine glass because I just thought at least just got one we don't drink red wine I thought if we get normal, like most people we know actually drink gin so I got a pack of four so I thought if I get someone that wants wine then you know I need to have, have at least one um I've got my carafe <laughs> let's just hope Thomas doesn't go mad about that one and then I've got these gin glasses just take a look at these let me put you there these gin glasses are honestly so nice. I had to ask the guy in the shop. I was like, what one do you like? I'm such a nightmare when it comes to decisions. Like, do not take me shopping. I'm the worst ever. Worst at making decisions. Right, these are the gin glasses. Do you like those? I thought they're proper fancy, aren't they? Um, yeah, cute. I'm well happy with them. Hey, everyone. So we have had Giggling Squid for dinner take away and it is now 9.15 and let's chill out and watch Lufa. I put my idiot on, I'm feeling so tired today and I just want to relax. So normally like in my daily routine um, I will go for my afternoon walk which isn't normally done now but it just happened to be done now today. Um, then I'll come back do a few hours of work, um, most days of the week before I teach dance. Um, and then have some dinner and then I literally get peppermint tea which I'm going to do right now and then just chill but guys I just want to say a big thank you for watching this video please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and don't forget to subscribe to my channel because um, every little helps it really your support really does uh, allow me to see these videos so yeah and if you want to apply for some coaching if you want to get into your fitness um then please do let me know and i've always got space for one more so guys thank you so much for watching this video i will see you in the next one which i'm thinking might be a weight fluctuation video so you'll be able to see my weight and how it fluctuates and how drastic it can be and that it does happen let me know if you'd like to see that. It'd be a Monday to Friday kind of video, like everyday vlog style. Let me know what you think in the comments below if you made it this far to the video. Thank you so much for watching once again. A big love to you all. And see you next time. Bye.